this year has been an incredibly transformational year for me, um, which has been a tough and challenging process, but one that I'm so thankful for. God has taught me so much. I've just got, got three bits to quickly share now. Um, so firstly, this year has been faith building. Um, my faith for the presence of God, my faith for God to do miracles has just increased so much just through, through seeing God do stuff. Um, and also, I guess, just um, learning and knowing that God really is speaking to us a lot and seeing other people grow in that as well has been really encouraging. Um, secondly... This, this year has been identity forming. Um, God has spoken truth over so many lies that I didn't even realise I was believing. And that's that's something that, you know, God... I've got a long way to go in and God's going to continue doing, but just I've made big steps of progress in that this year. Um, and that's increased my confidence in God and it's increased my confidence in myself. And my third point is, is actually really similar to the, the second one about identity, but... It's just so big. God really loves me, and it's it's such a fundamental thing. But I've I've really grown in knowing that more and more this year. And again, that's a continual process and something God's gonna keep on showing me. Um, but I've made a lot of progress in that this year. Um, one of my favourite songs is the In Christ Alone, and there's a line in it that says, "Here in the love of Christ I stand," which I just absolutely love. Um, Wherever I'm standing, I'm standing in God's love. So as FP comes to an end and there's a lot of change and uncertainty, I know that whatever job I'm in, wherever I am, whoever I'm with, I'm standing in Christ's love. And so that's something that I'm really going to be holding on to as, um, as everything changes, that here in the love of Christ I stand.